still human, are you? Then I am in luck. Could you help me? As you can see, I am stuck without recourse. Thank you. Yes, sincerely. I am Knight Lautrec of Karim. I truly appreciate this. And I guarantee a reward. Only later. What have we here? You look awfully raggedy. Times are grim. The least you can do is look sharp. Don't you dare meet my lady like that. You might scare her off for good. Oh, you again. What business have you? I don't suppose we can help, though. We accompany my lady on her righteous mission. It is quite a chore, but I'm stuck with her. And Nico, too. I can't very well abandon them now. Oh. You are undead as well. Then we've no time to fraternize. I have my mission and you no doubt have yours. We must not let this curse overcome us. Did I not explain the urgency of our tasks? Or are you so uncouth as to lack such judgment? By the looks of you, I should think not. Did I not explain? Oh, hello. My guests have finally arrived. I will be departing with them shortly. So, I'm afraid I will be saying goodbye soon. It was a pleasure. Oh, hello. Miracle. An undead mission? Regrettably, I cannot share that with you. But you are my pupil. Perhaps if you show your faith. Very well. I can surely tell you, of all people, undead clerics are given a mission to seek kindling. Kindling is the art of feeding bonfires with humanity. Through kindling, we shall one day be granted magnificent powers. Rhea is the youngest daughter of the good house of Thurland. Those young knights are her old schoolmates. But I'm not sure what to make of them. I'm afraid they may be a bad influence. Rhea is the... Oh, it's you. We're to leave momentarily. The catacombs aren't exactly my idea of a good time, but what can one do? I do hope we meet again, Rarya Knox. Did I not expect? Oh, hello. Miracles, I... Rhea is the young... Come again. choice indeed. Maiden Thuraland and her followers recently arrived in this land, but she became stranded deep below the catacombs. Her followers either fled or were reduced to hollows, leaving Maiden Thuraland all alone. Not a bad tip, huh? A new bar cleric would be replete with humanity. Hmm? That tip I gave you? I heard. 
heard it from a fleeing old man. That poor bastard. All his robes and trinkets won't help him now. <laughs> oh, hello there. Have you spoken with Sir Lautrec? Splendid. In the depths of the catacombs, Milady slipped off the giant's coffin and into a hole. Her two companions are no longer human, and the lass weeps in solitude. Right now, you could do as you please with her. The poor little purebred is entirely helpless. <laughs> Come again. The effectiveness of... In the depths of the catacombs, Milady slipped off the giant's coffin and into a hole. Her two companions are no longer human, and the lady weeps in solitude. <laughs> Come again. The... Oh, hello. Miracles, I presume? Come again. The You're no hollow, are you? Thank goodness. Please be careful. There are two fierce hollows not far from here. They were once brave knights, and my former escorts. Who would let such strong spirits be hollowed so? Heavens. Is there nothing, nothing at all to be done? You banished those two hollows, did you? It pains me to think of the trouble my failings have caused. I am certain that both Vince and Nico are grateful to you. Thank you so very much. Here, these belonged to them. You deserve them more than I. I am certain that both Vince and Nico are grateful to you. Thank you so very much. Oh, it's you. You rescued, milady. Well, a pity that is, for it will amount to nothing. For the little madam is not worth her salt without her family name. <laughs>
I am most pleased to find you in good health. I am ready. Let us speak of miracles. Then be safe. Farewell, very Knox. Fool, driven to madness by emotion, so be it. You'll make a fine hollow. You can waltz in the infernal depths together. Wrong. Oh. 